Hello and welcome to Procedural Fences in Houdini and Unreal. In this course you will learn how to create your first procedural asset and use it inside of Unreal using Houdini Engine with a start to finish example. This will allow you to discover the possibilities of what Houdini can do for your game development and asset creation workflows. This is a great 101 for people just getting started and wanting to learn about procedural modeling techniques. At the end of this course you will be able to create your own simple procedural tools with user controls, game engine collision, and efficient mesh instancing. I am Matthew Jukes, a CG educator and technical artist with over six years of Houdini experience, and I've created this tutorial based on my experience creating and developing procedural workflows for my own projects and tools. In the first chapter, you will learn how to import pre-built assets and create a modular setup with user controls. Then we will set up Houdini Engine and test our tool inside of Unreal Engine 4. In the second chapter, we will generate our own meshes with UV maps Using a range of techniques and controls, we will dip our toes into a small amount of Houdini's native coding language VEX, as well as creating low-res collision geometry for efficient game collisions. The key takeaways of this course will be basic Houdini usage and navigation, importing assets, instancing geometry, parameter linking for control creation, creating procedural meshes, game collision geometry creation, and setting up and using Houdini Engine for Unreal Engine 4. I'm very excited to share this knowledge with you all. Let's get started.